Hey guys, welcome back to the So Cassie channel and today we're gonna be seeing what $100 gets you at five different shoe stores. We're gonna be going to Payless, which is kind of on the cheaper end I'd say. You probably can get a couple, probably like, I bet you can get like four shoes from Payless for That's 100 bucks. something I grew up in. I grew up with getting Payless shoes as well. We're also gonna go to Vans, Nike, Skechers, and then last but not least, we're gonna go to Adidas. And also, I kinda wanna go to Louis Vuitton or like some sort of like upscale store just to see if there's anything possible, but I'm pretty sure there's not. But I think we should go to get started. This sounds kinda like a lot of like fun, just kinda like going off and seeing what you can get with a certain amount of money. So I think we should go ahead and jump right into it. Make sure you smash that thumbs up button, and make sure you guys leave in the poll out of those five stores that I listed off, which one is your guys' favorite? And let's get started. All right, so the first store we're going to is Nike. I'm not sure what I'm gonna be able to get from here. How expensive is Nike? I don't know. I wanna say they're like 50 bucks. So maybe I'll be able to get two pairs of shoes from here. Let's go check it out. Sometimes I'll find shoes that I really love, but the hardest thing is that a lot of places just never have my size. Cause I'm the smallest size for like women's adult shoes. I'm a size five. And I can already tell you that I've already liked some shoes and they don't have my size. Your size all the way up here. Yeah, it doesn't make sense to me. Can you reach? Why would they put size fives on the top shelf? People who are size five are not tall. <laughs> it's embarrassing. <laughs> Putting on my Pickle Rick socks to try on a pair of shoes. <sighs> my first options. All right, so apparently, I got like fat feet or something because these do not fit very comfortably. All right, surprisingly enough, I found these pair and I really like them. They fit really good on my feet and they have my size. And guess what? I think I have enough for another pair of shoes. So I'm gonna look for a second pair. So I've been looking for a while and I cannot find another pair of shoes that have my size and also look cool. So I'm gonna go ahead and look at their clothing because I got 60 bucks to blow. So I'm getting these pants and these are $35, which means I still have $15 to spend. No, 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 you gotta think of the tax. No, we're still with tax, I still got $15. <laughs> we, don't, we don't count tax here because that's silly. One more thing, come on. Socks? No. Is this $15? Oh, I guess you have to go with your pair of socks. Vans, here we go. I really like Van shoes. I'm worried about the price. I think they're pretty pricey, just kind of like Nike. So let's go check it out what we can get from here. Ooh, the sun came out. All right, so we're here at Van store and I don't see a lot of options for women. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna pass this off to Carlos. All right, Carlos, you get to pick shoes that add up to $100. You ready? Add up to $100? Yep. I want two pairs of those ones right there. What, you can't? Oh my gosh, you're too easy. Let's go see. We'll All right, let's keep looking. I haven't been here in a long time. Really excited for Adidas. Let's go see what we can find. You know, get one pair anyways. I know, anyways, they're pretty expensive here. I'm pretty sure most of the shoes are about 80 and up. So I don't think I'm gonna be able to get a second pair of shoes here. All right, so for our last and final store, we're supposed to be going to Payless. However, I recently just found out that Payless is actually closed indefinitely. Every Payless is closed, which I had no idea about. So for our last and final store, we'll be going to Ross, which I thought would be probably like the next best place. So let's go to Ross and see what kind of shoes we can find. I think we're gonna be able to get a good load here. There are so many shoe options here at Ross. I'm shocked. And away we go. So we got all of our shoes. I think it's time to go home and show me, show you guys what I got from each store. Okay, so it is time to go over what we were able to get at five different stores for $100. So I'm gonna show you guys the first store we went to, which was Nike. You got one small bag. I got one small bag, and surprisingly, I was only able to get one pair of shoes, actually, because they did not have any deals there. So I ended up getting these shoes. All right, so these shoes were actually $50, and because of my sizing problem, which I'm a size five, and a lot of places just don't carry size fives, I went ahead and just rounded up my 100 by buying us a pair of sweats. 
and a beanie, which made my grand total of $93. This is my haul from Nike. The next store we went to is we went to Vans. Now Vans, I thought it was gonna be similar to Nike, but it had a kind of a BOGO, so it was buy one, get one half off. So Carlos actually ended up getting a pair of shoes, which I really like his shoes. I think they look super cool. And I was also able to get a pair of shoes as well. I got these really nice red ones. I actually wore these today because I thought they were that nice. They ended up giving my feet blisters though. <laughs> so, the total for that was a little bit low, so we were able to grab a shirt for like 10 bucks. This is just Carlos's shirt he got, and it rounded up to a nice $94. So we're at $93 and $94. But we got two pairs of shoes for this, which I thought was pretty cool. Oh, and the next thing we got was we went to Skechers. Now, Skechers was the same idea. It was really hard to find a size for me, so Carlos ended up getting some nice shoes here. We got some nice, just really nice, comfortable flip flops, actually. These are really good. These were about 30 bucks actually, which I thought was a little pricey. Not as cheap as I thought. Yeah, we got a pair of socks, and then we were able to get a pair of Skechers shoes. These are actually pretty nice, pretty cool. Not my favorite, but they're memory foam, so they're really comfortable, I think. <laughs> and then, you know, to top off the amount to even close to 100 bucks, Cassie we went. had to buy candy. Cassie ah! wanted to buy some candy. <laughs> And our, actually, our total came out to $84. Oh no, $90, wait now, $84. Which again, what they do here at these places is they don't tell you the deals they have. And then you go there and you get shoes and then it's way cheaper than you think it is because they forget to tell you that's like buy one, get one. Yeah, they have a red tag and then you go to the register and then we be like, no, it's uh, the percentage off that red tag. I'm like, I thought the red tag was a percentage. Yeah, it, it does not make any sense at all. It's really confusing. So I don't even think we actually spent $100 until we actually went to Adidas. There we go. Okay, so Adidas, I was shocked by the pricing actually, because it was really expensive. It was like $80, $90, $70. Some were $200. Some were $200. And so Carlos and I, we ended up getting a pair of shoes. Here's the pair of shoes I got. These were $65. But when we went to the front, they said these shoes were only like $32. So. Now those were $39.99. And then it was half off of those. Was it? So yeah. they, these were only 20 bucks? No, no. Oops. No, wait, they were 60. I tell you, it's right there on no, the side. No, these shoes were $32. Oh, yeah. They were 65, 65. and we got them half off. Yeah, 65. So half off. when we found out these were $32, we went back and got Carlos a pair of shoes. So we were able to get two pairs of shoes over at Adidas. Here's what Carlos ended up getting. He ended up getting an all black shoe. And these were expensive too, but they were half off again. These were like $85 and we got them for $42. So we spent like $80 in shoes. So that gave us $20. And then we ended up going back. And what did we get? We got two beanies for $10 two each. Two beanies. Because <laughs> everything was just half off. It was so confusing. And they didn't even promote it until we got to the front. We thought we were going to spend over 100 bucks. And then they were like, this is only $80. No, we thought we were only going to buy a pair of shoes for you. Yeah. Not even the 100 bucks. Really, really, we did. So that was really shocking to me that we were able to get two yeah, pairs so of shoes from Adidas. So definitely Adidas was better than Nike and Vans. But that's just because of the deal they had. If it wasn't for the deal they had, it would have been pretty expensive. I've never been to Adidas and this 50% off, 95% of the store. It's like if it's going out of business or something. Ross. Ross. I had no idea Payless would be closed. I'm still shocked by that. I really wanted to go to Payless. But we got a pretty good haul at Ross. We ended up getting... So I ended up getting two sandals for myself here. Carlos got a pair of sandals. And then we ended up getting two pairs of kids' shoes just for some kids. The hardest part about Ross was the sizing. They and would just have... They'd have like this shoe all the way over there. And then they would just have this shoe like over there. <laughs> and they just expected you to look for the shoes. And then the shoes that we didn't want... They had two right foots and I couldn't find the yeah. left foot. And then they even told us that they thought that maybe some kid out there is probably having two left shoes because they only have two rights. <laughs> so Ross is really annoying, but we were able to get five pairs of shoes for actually less than $100, I'm pretty sure. And what are we going to do with all these shoes, sweetie? We do not eat all these shoes. Oh, 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 oh. Speak for yourself, Carlos. Just <laughs> kidding. I'm not sure yet we're going to do these shoes. We'll probably end up donating some of these shoes. But you know what? That is it for today's video. Let me know, guys, out of these five stores, which one did you guys like the most? I think I personally really like Adidas and I really like Vans. 
Those are my, probably my favorite stores of all times right now. So let me know which one is your guys' favorite. Let me know if you guys like this video. This is something a little bit different on the channel. I really just wanted to have something a little more fun, different. Let me know if you guys liked it. And with that, we'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.